So anyway, we're on our way home from a fun trip on a quest for tacos. But we took the old road, the old ridge route, that used to run, for, well it still does run mostly from Bakersfield to Los Angeles and back. It was built in 19... 1914. 1914. Yeah. Paved with concrete in 1920 and then bypassed when they built the five. Now, a lot of people will say Interstate 5 or I-5. I'm a Southern California guy. It's the 5, all right? Uh, the 5. I, I grew up in Maine. <clears throat> Where does the V come? Why are you, all your roads named the? Because the we five. have so many interstates in Southern California. The 99. We have so many interstates in Southern California that people... Sometimes the people on uh, reporters, traffic reporters, KFIs, eye in the sky, flying by, saying hi, kind of guy, they'll give you the name of the freeway. And it's like, we don't know the name of the freeway. Nobody cares about the name of the freeway. <laughs> the 10 is the San Bernardino freeway. It turns into the Santa Monica freeway. They, they change names all over the place. It's the 10, okay? And you got the 605. You got you got the 5. You got the 405. I mean, there's too many of them to have names for them. And we just call them the... Whatever. Whatever. All right, all anyway, right. well, we were the on, 5 is right over there. We were on <clears throat> the ridge route. The ridge route. Mm -hmm. Okay? Old, old... It, there's there's videos about it on YouTube and there will be another video about it on YouTube when I get done editing we got a lot of video thing is we didn't find any tacos no we didn't even find any <clears throat> we didn't even find any inns there wasn't even a gas station or... like all the inns <clears throat> are gone they're they're out of, fresh out of inns little there bits weren't of, any little bit of stone here and there yeah but we found a lot of the stone Oh my goodness, and, and the scenery. I'll put a, oh. When I get that all edited, I'll put a link in the description of this one. The ridge route was a fun drive. You got to do a little bit of research to find out how to get to it. And then, yeah. I we, could be easily convinced to go back. It was spectacular. It was, well, it was over 100 degrees most of the day. That's all even right. Even up on top, because it does have some altitude to it. Yeah, it does. It's on the ridge. It runs higher than the five. But anyway, on the way home, when you get to the bottom of the, the grade, the first off-ramp is called Grapevine. Yeah. Don't go there. Unless you're trying to drive the, the ridge route. You're not going to drive very much of it from there either. But the the next one to the north is Laval. Yes. It's where the... It's uh, where the Tijon <clears throat> outlet stores are. Yeah, the outlet stores are over on the other side of the freeway. <clears throat> on this side of the freeway, you got Denny's, Best Western, Petro, Starbu Truck Stop. Starbucks. Starbucks. Mm -hmm. you, got, you got a bunch of stuff over but here. There's a McDonald's and an In-N-Out. In and out is good. All, yes, the, yes, all the big chains. You notice I didn't say McDonald's. In and out is good, and they, they even have a Chipotle for people who are so inclined. But right next to the Chipotle, actually, the other side of the same building is Roll 'em Up Taquitos. Yeah. Which... Very limited menu. They got taquitos and nachos. Yeah. And some sides. You got rice, beans, esquite. You can get elote here. They call it street corn <coughs> for the street elote. Corn. And they call it corn in a cup for the esquite. But when I ordered esquite, she knew what I meant. It's all delicious, okay? Oh my God, so we so got, good. We got a four-pack of taquitos. And these are, these are not buy them at the grocery store taquitos. Oh. These are good. Cooked to a perfect... Let, let me... We couldn't shoot the video in the restaurant because it was too crowded and noisy. There's only one left. They're good size. 
yeah, they're pretty healthy size. But we also got a churro donut, which I haven't tasted, but she has oh and says it's just God. absolutely wonderful. It's it's orgasmic. That's one. One taquito. There was four in here. And you can I can't believe you ate two taquitos. I did. And I ate about That's, three of the chips from the nachos, yeah. but I should probably taste this donut. You need to taste that because that's not just any donut. That is a churro donut. Did the regular I, donuts just won't do it for you after that. Did I steer you wrong? That's that good. That thing is exquisite. Churros are wonderful. Donuts are wonderful. And you can get all the toppings on it that you would get on a, you know, they, they put the caramel on it, the cinnamon, all the good jazz. If Homer Simpson ever finds out about that. Oh, we're in trouble then. There won't be any for the rest of us. Really? <clears throat> now the taquitos, you can get ground beef, you can get shredded beef, you can get potato, you can get cheese. Yes. I didn't know all you that. You can get potato. You I can, didn't read the whole menu. You can get cheese, wow. you can also get shredded chicken. So we got shredded chicken and shredded beef. They were actually ground, I believe. No, ours was shredded. Was it? Yeah, ours was shredded. It looked like it was ground. The bottom of my taquito fell off because it had so much stuff in it. <laughs> and there was uh, just like this little roll of meat. And I was just eating the tortilla with all of the, the toppings on it. And it was good enough without even any meat in it. Even better, you have a choice. They're making them right there for you. They're not frozen and deep fried. Well, they're deep fried, but they're not frozen and pre-prepared. Fresh made. They're fresh made. You can get corn tortillas or you can get flour tortillas. So you have a choice. Fried flour tortillas are awesome. With potato filling? Well, that would be any of them. <laughs> any of them would be good. But anyway, on the nachos. <clears throat> They're not just nachos. We got the Avo God nachos. And they are not and kidding. They call them Bomb AF. And they are telling the truth. Now, this is kind of half of them because yeah, we, consoli we, already ate. we consolidated our leftovers. But you've got nachos with an avocado sauce That's which is not guacamole kind of spicy for me but it was too hot for her it's got cilantro in it too. super tasty but just a little bit of heat which is too hot for her mm -hmm. but then there was a big pile of guacamole over here in the corner mm, and there was it's a good scoop ground beef and cheese and you can and pick you pick whatever protein you want on there oh I my goodness did have them leave off the habanero sauce because i definitely wouldn't be able to eat it then there's the, the esquites the, the remains and there's the the beans and rice which what we had left over i took the leftover beans put them on top of the rice but you know you get a you it's, get a good sized cup it's of a the size portion and uh and the rice is really the, good. It's not dry. It's flavorful. Oh, yeah. The rice was delicious. It's moist. The beans, perfectly <clears throat> cooked. So they still have some texture. You have some whole beans in there. Yeah. Soupy, but whole beans, too. Yeah. Very good flavor so good. and everything. But the, the taquitos, if you buy two, four, eight, whatever, however many taquitos, you get rice and beans with it. Well, and they have a party pack, <coughs> so you a, you can get two different sizes of party pack. Oh my goodness, that is going to be a lot of taquitos. Now and, tell tell these fine people what we're drinking here. Oh, okay. We had originally only got one drink that came with the taquito combo meal. We had to go back and get another one because this is that good. So they have slushies, including horchata <coughs> flavored slushies, mango flavored slushies. Um, they also have a self-serve fountain. And then I guess these would be like agua fresca, kind of? Yeah, kind of like that. Um, this one? There was oh. lemonade, there was, there was un unsweetened, un unsweetened iced, iced tea. tea, lemonade. They had a berry blast, which is a mixed berry kind of a drink. This one is 
hands down the best. This is strawberry dragon fruit pomegranate. I didn't know those silly ass electric cars did that. Uh, okay, I didn't know they had a gull wing door, but apparently they do. But she didn't unplug it. Is she going to drive off with the charging cord still plugged in? It's probably not charged yet. They've only been here for two hours. Uh. But the, the door... Yeah, if you have a Tesla, by the way, there's a massive Tesla charging station. That's what we're looking at. Yeah. Across the freeway from... The, they've probably got another one over on that side of the freeway at the outlets. That stuff is tasty. Oh, I'm having a moment. Sorry, the, They had the soda machine, which... I'm, yeah, the, the soda I'm, machine doesn't have anything for her. I'm having a thing here. We're, we're you know... Well, it was yes. interesting, the gull wing on the door, I've never seen it do it before, because uh, I, I really don't pay much attention to Teslas, but instead of, let's say, if the car is facing at you, the gull wing door doesn't just open like this, because that means you got to have more clearance on this side, it folds up as it opens and then lifts up. That's kind of interesting to watch. That's kind of a neat engineering but just, Feet. That much more. Oh, okay. She remembered. She's on. <coughs> She's unplugging. I'm sure that if you try to drive that car away, it's, plugged in, it's, it, it's going to tell you because it gonna, does. It's going to holler at you. <laughs> <coughs> they when don't, you buy a Tesla, Tesla just assumes you don't know how to drive. Well, they don't <coughs> have a dash cluster. All they have is a tablet mounted in the front. But anyway. Yeah. Uh. Roll them up taquitos, and they don't have one in Bakersfield. I guess they're, they're out of Los Angeles, so if you're in the Los Angeles area, look them up. If you're coming down, up or down the five, jump off of there. These guys Ugh. are good. Multiple thumbs up. Oh, thumbs up, toes up, everything up. So good. Now, we had a real fun day. What I want you guys to do is have fun. All right, because it, it's it's the best way to do things. Just make sure you enjoy it all. All right, I've I've been in the hospital and had fun because I insisted on it. I've been having a terrible, crazy, no good, bad day at work and still had fun. <clears throat> the nurses didn't like it when I had fun, but yeah, well, I did it anyway. <laughs> you guys have fun. We're out of here. Thanks for watching.